Now turn to Section 1. Section 1. You will hear a woman telephoning a travel agency for a hotel inquiry. First, you have some time to look at questions 1 to 5. You will see that there is an example that has been done for you. On this occasion only, the conversation relating to this will be played first. Nature Travel Agency, how may I help you? Hi, good morning. My family and I plan to travel to Vancouver for a vacation, and we would like to see if you could book a hotel for us. The destination is Vancouver, so Vancouver has been written in the space. Now we shall begin. You should answer the questions as you listen because you will not hear the recording a second time. Listen carefully and answer questions 1 to 5. Nature Travel Agency, how may I help you? Hi, good morning. My family and I plan to travel to Vancouver for a vacation and we would like to see if you could book a hotel for us. No problem. First, I'll need to get some particulars. Can you give me your full name? Anna Hardy. Hi, Anna. We have a hotel in Vancouver named Holiday Chilcotton, which is very popular with guests on vacation. Hmm, Chilcotton. How do you spell that? It's a local hotel. C-H-I-L-C-O-T-I-N. Where is it? Is it in the city center? You see, my family likes to stay in a quiet area for vacation. Not too buzzy, you know. Oh, no worries. It's near a train station. Oh, I think that's fine. I am traveling with my husband. Is the hotel expensive? Well, in your case, I think a double room would suit you well. It will cost you $169 a night if you make a pre-booking. Normally, it's $210. That sounds pretty reasonable. I'd like to book for five days from 21 June through the 25th. Are there still rooms available? Oh, let me check. Ah, uh, yes, they still have some vacant rooms. Would you like to book it now? One more question first. Does the price include meals? Well, breakfast is provided from 7 to 10, but for lunch and dinner you need to pay separately. All right. Please book it for me. Is there anything we can do near the hotel? Actually, there is a science museum funded by the city council just 10 minutes away. Excellent. My husband will love it. Before you hear the rest of the conversation, you have some time to look at questions 6 to 10. Now listen and answer questions 6 to 10. Do you have any outdoor activities to recommend? We don't like to stay in the hotel all day long. Oh, yes. If you like to go cycling, there is a shop near the hotel where you can rent a bike. Helmets are provided, but you'll have to take your own boots. That sounds nice. I think I'll do that. Also, it's an ideal place for visitors who like to go mountain climbing. Oh, we really enjoy that. The hotel arranges two trips to a nearby mountain. One trip is at 9 in the morning and one trip is at 2 in the afternoon each day. You just need to call reception to make a reservation. And it's free of charge. Fires are not allowed, but you can go fishing in the lakes if you like. For camping, a tent can be borrowed for a rest from the driver. Oh, I can't wait. It sounds like a lot of fun. If you'd like some adventure, you can go hiking in the forest. Sometimes you can even see some black bears, but you must be very careful. Oh my God, we don't like to take risks while traveling. One last thing. There is a visit to an ancient gold mine every afternoon. If you're interested, just call reception. I think we will do that. Thank you so much for your help. You are more than welcome. That is the end of Section 1. You now have half a minute to check your answers. 